Hello viewers, welcome to our channel Impressive Facts. In this video, we are going to learn some of the very interesting and impressive facts about the planet Jupiter. Jupiter is the fifth planet from the Sun in the solar system. It is one of the largest and the biggest planets which is two and a half times more massive than all the other planets combined in the solar system. Jupiter is also known as a gas giant since it is made primarily of gases such as hydrogen and helium. Jupiter is given its name after the king of the Roman gods. Jupiter can be seen by the naked eye in the night sky without using any advanced telescopes. It is the fourth brightest object in the solar system after Sun, Moon and Venus. Let's talk about the specifications of Jupiter. The specifications about Jupiter were first recorded by Babylonian astronomers in 7th or 8th century BC. That tells us that Jupiter has a distance of 476 million miles or 767 million kilometers from the Sun. The length of a year on Jupiter is equivalent to 4,333 Earth days. It takes about 42.6 minutes for the sunlight to reach its surface. The equatorial diameter of Jupiter is 142,000 km, while its polar diameter is 133,000 km. The surface temperature of Jupiter is minus 108 degrees centigrade. Jupiter takes about 11.8 Earth years to complete its orbit around the Sun. Therefore, one year on Jupiter is equivalent to 11.8 Earth years. Jupiter has the shortest day compared to all the other planets in the solar system that lasts for only 10 hours. Jupiter has four rings. Its ring system is very thin and it is not clearly visible. These rings are formed by the impact from incoming comets and asteroids. These rings are composed mainly of dust particles. They are between 2000 to 12,500 kilometers thick. Let's talk about Jupiter's atmosphere. Jupiter has a very thick atmosphere. It is the largest planetary atmosphere in the solar system. It is composed primarily of hydrogen, which is about 90%, and helium about 10%. Therefore, it doesn't have a solid surface. It also contains some other gases in a much smaller amounts, such as ammonia, methane, and water. Jupiter has unique cloud features. The beautiful whirling clouds and storms that we see on Jupiter are only about 50 km thick. These clouds are made up of ammonia crystals, sulfur, mixtures of the two compounds and are broken down into two cloud decks. The darker portion is believed to be made up of compounds that are brought up from deeper inside Jupiter and on reacting with sunlight it then changes its color. Below the clouds is just hydrogen and helium all the way to the bottom. Jupiter has a giant swirling storm known as the Great Red Spot which is twice the width of Earth. It is located south of Jupiter's equator. It is so large that two or three Earth-sized planets could easily fit into it. According to astronomers, this giant storm was created by Jupiter's turbulent and fast-moving atmosphere that has been raging for at least 350 years and it is still active. It was first observed in the 17th century 
when telescopes were first started to be used. This red spot of Jupiter spins anti-clockwise and takes six Earth days to rotate completely. The red color is due to the presence of red organic compounds according to the several theories proposed by different scientists. Jupiter's interior core below its massive atmosphere is made up of ice, rocks, metals, liquid metallic hydrogen, and layers of compressed hydrogen gas. Do you know that Jupiter is one of the fastest spinning planets in the solar system? One day on Jupiter lasts for only 10 Earth hours. Because of the planet's rapid spinning, it has become a little flattened at the poles and is bulging at its equator, giving it an oblate shape. Jupiter's rapid rotation on its axis helps to generate the powerful magnetic field. Its magnetic field is about 20 times stronger than Earth's magnetic field. The gravity on Jupiter is greater than the gravity on Earth because Jupiter is more massive. Although it is huge and larger in size, its surface gravity is just 2.4 times that of the surface gravity of Earth because it is made up of mostly gases. Assuming if you weigh 100 pounds on Earth, then you would weigh about 240 pounds on Jupiter. In our previous videos, we have learned that Earth has only one moon, whereas Mars has two moons. But you would be surprised to know that Jupiter has 79 moons discovered so far. The largest four moons in order of the distance from Jupiter are Io, Europa, Ganymede, and Callisto. These four moons are called the Galilean moons because they were first discovered by the astronomer Galileo Galilei in 1610. Out of these four moons, Ganymede is the Jupiter's largest moon in the solar system with a diameter of 3,273 miles. Io consists of a lot of active volcanoes and is covered with sulfur. Callisto has a heavily cratered icy, rocky surface that may have a water ocean beneath its surface. Europa may have a liquid water ocean which is covered by a cracked, icy surface. The other moons of Jupiter are smaller and have irregular shapes. Most of these small moons are believed to be asteroids which were captured by Jupiter's strong gravity. There have been several missions to Jupiter. Let's talk about it. Jupiter has been visited by nine spacecraft so far. NASA's Pioneer 10 was the first spacecraft to visit Jupiter in December 1973 followed by Pioneer 11 in December 1974. The Voyager twin missions, Voyager 1 and 2 flybys, were launched in late 1977 that flew past Jupiter in 1979. Both missions are still active and studying the interstellar space. In October 1989, Galileo spacecraft was launched and it became the first spacecraft to orbit Jupiter when it arrived in December 1995. Ulysses, which was a NASA European Space Agency joint mission, was a space probe launched in 1990. It arrived at Jupiter in Feb 1992 and measured the planet's magnetosphere. Then in October 1997, Cassini Hygiene spacecraft was launched, which made its closest approach to Jupiter in December 2000, while on its way to Saturn, its main target. 
The NASA New Horizons spacecraft mission was launched in January 2006 that flew past Jupiter in February 2007. Juno, a NASA mission which is currently exploring this giant world, was launched in August 2011. It is the second spacecraft to orbit Jupiter after Galileo. It entered a polar orbit of Jupiter in July 2016 and is expected to be completed in July 2021. Wasn't it interesting to learn about the unique facts about the largest planet of the solar system? What do you think? Please let us know by leaving a comment below in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please do like, share and subscribe to my channel for more interesting and impressive facts.